What to do if Galaxy S10 has no sound during calls? Calling issues can take many forms. In this video we will show what to do if there's no sound during calls on your Galaxy S10. First, check network signal strength. This is one of the calling problems that we've encountered on this device so far so hopefully this brief guide will help. This type of issue is more likely caused by something on the network side than by a device fault so your first move is to ensure that you have good or excellent signal. If calls tend to be problematic while you're inside a building try to move out and see if it improves. Being in an open area greatly enhances the capability of your Galaxy S10 to receive signals. Next, reset network settings. Most network troubles including calling problems can easily be fixed by doing a simple troubleshooting step resetting network settings. Calling issues are sometimes due to incorrect network configuration. This happens for many reasons but you can ensure that all network settings are fine by resetting them. Next, clear phone app cache and data. Clearing the cache of a problem app is another basic troubleshooting step that you can do in this situation. It will remove the temporary files and create a new one after launching the app again. Another way to directly deal with your phone app is to reset its settings to defaults, but make sure to create a backup to all your contacts before you proceed. Next, install updates. Although not generally known by many Android users installing updates sometimes also bring needed fixes for known bugs. Make sure that you don't delay the installation of any system or app updates. By default your S10 should notify you of any available updates but in case you turn this mechanism off, it's high time that you manually check for them. Next, confirm Bluetooth is off. Are you using a wireless headset from time to time? If yes then make sure that your phone's audio during calls is not being forwarded to your headset. To do that, make sure that Bluetooth is off on your Galaxy S10. Just pull the notification bar down and tap on Bluetooth icon to turn it off. Then try making a call to see if that helps. Next, perform force reboot. Should the problem return after rebooting the app itself, the next thing that you want to do is perform a soft reset. This should clear the system and possibly get rid of the bug as well. To do that, simply press and hold the power and volume down buttons for about 10 seconds. This is usually effective in clearing bugs that develop when a system is left running for some time. Next, verify audio settings are configured correctly. There may be times that an app or service may modify sound settings without your knowledge. To check you go under settings greater than sound and vibration and enable all relevant options for you. Next, reset app preferences. Some apps need other apps or default services in order to work. To ensure that all the right default apps and services are up and running you want to try to reset app preferences and see what happens. Next, check for bad app. If you notice that your Galaxy S10 has no sound during calls right after installing an app, try to delete the app and see how it works. Some bad or poorly coded apps may interfere with Android and cause problems. If you are not sure whether or not you have installed a bad app, you can verify it by restarting to safe mode. Next, clear cache partition. Android depends on a set of temporary files called system cache to load apps quickly. If this cache gets corrupted or updated a device may suddenly lag freeze or show signs of slow performance at other times and common glitches may occur as well as overall performance of the system may also be affected. To ensure that your S10 has good system cache we suggest that you clear it once every few months. Next, factory reset. The final device troubleshooting that you can try is factory reset. This will help if there's an unknown software bug that causes the problem. Make sure to create a backup of your personal data ahead of time. Lastly, contact network operator. 
All the solutions mentioned are meant to fix bugs in the device, however if none of them helped and there's still no sound during calls the most likely culprit is on the network side. Make sure to talk to your network operators so they can help you identify the cause of the problem. We hope that this guide has been helpful. Please support us by seeking like, share, subscribe and hit the notification bell for more troubleshooting videos.